What is up everybody? It's Joe from JLW Games coming at you with another cool video and we're finally back in Wind Valley Park, our challenge park for the 50th episode and we're about to celebrate our 50th anniversary of this park being open as we you can see we are in year 49 and we're getting ready to prepare for year 50 which will be the park's 50th anniversary. <laughs> Now when we left off, we relocated a ride from this section over here over to this section hoping that it would maybe gain some more traction and more guest flow going around this way as we don't have a whole lot of guests walking this way due to um, not having much over here. It was just kind of here to connect the back part of the park to the front of the park uh, because this used to be the front and then we moved it to the back kind of. We changed where the entrance was a uh, way long time ago, um, and now, now, the park is just huge, so. <laughs> now, uh, going over to what I've done off screen just real quick, because I did forget to delete the, um, the old chair swing, which is now uh, just an empty lot. I do have a plan, potentially, of what this is going to become, because this will free up some spot or from some real estate right here, some prime real estate if we remove these two rides because I'm thinking about changing up the area or where the teacups go too because as you can see, we've had seven lifetime guests on this ride. Seven. So obviously it's not doing well in its location and we need to find it a new home. Uh, so obviously since that doesn't work out, well, basically this section does is going to be kind of non-existent. It used to be kind of supposed, was supposed to be kind of a kids area, but now it's going to kind of be revamped into more of a just a normal pathway coming along this way that leads you back to the space section because this is kind of like a space theme, I guess, because obviously with this and then of course we have the Star Flyer, which is also space theme. We might actually kind of revamp this whole area as a new spacey kind of like a space theme to kind of match the theming of um, Star Rush and Star Flyer. So uh, I think that would be kind of fitting for this uh, to be kind of become its own actual area because it was kind of like this over here and uh, this wasn't really anything except kind of like a mini kids area with two kind of smaller kid rides. But since that didn't really make sense, um, I am planning on maybe removing both of these rides or at least relocating them. So we might relocate the teacups maybe somewhere. I don't know if they'll fit anywhere over here. We could potentially make some room and try and fit it somewhere over here, but I don't think it's going to be the easiest thing to do. But you never know. We'll figure it out as we go along. So you might be wondering, what are we going to be doing for the 50th season here in Wind Valley Park? And I think a lot of you actually kind of guessed it. Um, no, we're not going to be building some crazy big roller coaster. And so before you click off the video, though, <laughs> after hearing that news, uh, just stick around to what we're, go we're going to do. So what we're actually going to do is we are going to do a fireworks show um, for the 50th anniversary, and we're just going to be celebrating in the 50th year. So we're not getting anything substantial ride-wise, but uh, we are going to try and make it a mem memorable uh, thing. So, like, anyways, I haven't really messed with fireworks too much in Planet Coaster, so hopefully that won't be too much of a huge issue or anything. But we are going to try and create a pretty epic fireworks show for on Valley Park. The first thing is first, we gotta figure out where we're gonna set these off, and I already have a good idea, and it's gonna be back over here in this backstage area, kind of back behind here, maybe on this road, or maybe even in this this little plot right here. So we get good from a good way to kind of get some fireworks going. It'll be really cool right up next to um, the RMC and everything with uh, <clears throat> Iron Rider and everything. I think it would be kind of neat to, to launch them off right here. So uh, let's go ahead and get started by pushing play. And um, <coughs> I don't have a whole lot of... Um, of experience to begin with in this regard when it comes to um, 
uh, fireworks and such, but um, that's okay. Sweet. Now, let's just get a glimpse of what this will be like. So we're going to start out like this. Boom. About a two minute and nine second show 
Oh, yeah. You gotta get with the... Different coasters here. I could have swore I added lighting to this right. <laughs> so maybe I didn't. Ooh, ah, right around the two minute marks when the finale begins, so. I'll make sure we get that. If you're at the entrance, you'll be able to see him pretty well. All right, finale starts in around 10 seconds. <coughs> Excuse me. Oh no, autosave. I'm gonna push pause while that does that. Here we go, finale time. Boom, boom, boom. Might do a little longer on the finale, cause or on the uh, fifty, cause real it really gets overshadowed by everything else. So let's go one. Let's uh, wait a few seconds before it starts. Looks great though. Comes the finale. I love this little thing at the end there. There's the 50. Boom. Nice. Turned out pretty good. At least I thought so. All right, now that we got that taken care of, we need to figure out some good music to sync up along with this. All right, we're going to add our speakers now. Go back to nighttime. And start. We're going to lick up. Yay. <clears throat> I love how the moon's right there, too. I just hope, like, the music's good enough for the finale. I think it just repeats what it's doing right now.
Here we go. Trying to take some screenshots here. Fifty. <laughs> Hey, they liked it. It gets really busy here, so this is a really good place to have it because it's a big, wide open path. And there is a lot of traffic going through here. So I do think this is a pretty solid place to have the show out. So a couple of little bit of lighting here for lightning chaser. At least on the tower. At the very least. We are probably going to reuse some stuff from these, like queue line fencing and decorations and stuff. From the previous rides in this spot. And the paths will be disconnected there. As the teacups are actually going to get relocated to a backstage area. Just gonna sit that back there closed <laughs> until they figure out what they want to do with it. There we go. So it looks like there was something there, but not anymore. All right, you're gonna see that they've done a little bit of work and clearing some land clearing here, just a little bit. So you can see some obvious uh, constructions happening over here. Thank oh gosh, you're gonna clean up bluegrass that fast. All right, it's going to start in one hour. It's still not dark. In fact, it's not even close to being dark yet. It's 8.30 at night. Oh no, it's going off. But it's not, it's not time yet. Shut down the production. Shut down the production! No! Why are you playing? I don't know why it's playing right now. Wait a minute. That's why it's not dark. I'm dumb. I am an idiot sometimes. That's okay. Continue. Ah. Uh, I guess I need to watch the time to make sure I know when it hits. <coughs> The first. Yay. So close.
Yay! Fifty! Look at that! Boom! That was like almost basically perfect timing. As soon as it hit fifty, we hit March first. Wow. That was cool. <clears throat> Alright guys, I hope you guys enjoyed this episode. Uh, if you did, make sure you comment, like, subscribe for more amazing content like this, of course. Uh, more episodes are going to be coming your way, hopefully pretty soon, as we start Season 6 of this uh, awesome series. So, I know Season 5 took a while to get through, um, but we made it through, and uh, I got some ideas for this next season. Uh, so, hopefully it'll be awesome as we celebrate the 50th anniversary of Wind Valley Park. It's been incredible. I hope you guys have enjoyed the series up to this point and continue to enjoy it as we move forward. We have Windleverse on the horizon as well, which will also be an awesome uh, series, which will be way better than this, in my opinion. So be sure to check out the Windleverse stuff when that drops. So anyways, um, again, we are sponsored by Dubby now as well. So make sure if you want some awesome energy drinks and you want to get a discount on those, use my code JLW Games. Uh, links in the description for that. And make sure you check out our merch as well. So make sure you guys have a great day and even cool tomorrow. And I'll catch you guys in the next live streamer video, whichever it may be. Thanks and goodbye.